Yo, what is going on with YouTube family? I just got back from watching The Last Voyage of the Demeter. This has been my most anticipated movie uh, of 2023. I love vampires, Dracula's dope, and what really caught my eye about this movie is the actual Dracula himself. It's not a man, it's a beast. And I like the more beastly look of Dracula, that's what really drew me in. But the story of the movie is, okay, there's this ship, the Demeter, uh, they're shipping cargo from Bulgaria, I believe they said. Yeah, Bulgaria to Europe, all right? And Dracula is on this cargo. They don't know it, and they soon realize something is going on when people start to go missing. Animals are getting killed, uh, stuff of that nature. And uh, yeah, they got to come together, figure out what's going on, and fight this evil. You know, powerful evil is on board. You know, but yo, this movie is really good. It, 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 it's, it has a good length. I really like how they use shadows to conceal Dracula. You don't see him a lot. And I remember the director saying in an interview that he wanted to make Alien, but on a ship. And I definitely see the inspiration of Alien in this movie. Cause you know, like in, uh, in Alien, the 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 xenomorph is in the shadow majority of the movie and you don't see a whole lot of the xenomorph it's kind of like jaws you don't see a whole lot of the the shark uh you know it's just the suspense of where is it is he is he around here is he over here in the shadows you know and i really did dig that about this movie they really use atmosphere to to um to create that that unsettling feeling right and as far as dracula you know i was more surprised about dracula in this movie than i thought it, i was gonna be because judging by the trailers it looked like dracula was like a beast this 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 uh this beast mindless beast this mindless creature but he's actually very cunning and they say that in the movie, like, no, he's not just a mindless beast. He's very cunning. And, you know what I'm saying? Make, thinking that he's a mindless beast is a, where it is a mistake, you know? Like, he, he, he can think through stuff. And he had a lot more personality uh, to him than I was expecting, you know? I'm talking about, like, when he makes a kill, you know, he, he gives him a smile. He even talks, you know? It's not like as I'm talking to you, but it's like in this growl, this, this low growling uh, type of voice. And I thought that was really cool. The look of him is really cool too. Uh, you know, him flying around just wrecking dudes is just hella cool watching it. You know, I'm gonna have to go back and watch that just just for that scene where he's just flying around. You know, uh, the crew itself is really cool. Uh, I was actually rooting for the the crew to to make it. You know. Um, Usually, I know that I'm not really inter interested in the characters when I'm wanting the bad guy to kill the characters off, but I wasn't. I was actually rooting for the the, the human characters to, you know, figure this thing out, come together, get their stuff together, and, uh, you know, do what they got to do to win. And this movie's ballsy. They make some ballsy decisions that I wasn't expecting them to do last. I'll say this. The last ballsy movie I would say that I've seen that made certain decisions was was it all right uh i'll just leave it at that but it is it, it's, it's a ballsy movie you know it's the link i didn't feel the link at all it's a good pause <laughs> it's a uh it, it's a good uh it's a good link to the film and i definitely think you will enjoy it you know uh for me i would say that the movie definitely did live up to the expectations i am gonna go back tomorrow and watch it i just really like i liked it that much uh you may not like it as much i mean critics uh i've seen on rotten tomatoes the the right the right tomato scores like at a 46 which i do not understand you know but film is subjective uh everybody has their own opinions about it so you may come out like in this movie or not but i know that i really dug the hell out of this movie and i hope it gets a sequel you know because i would like to see more of this version of uh count dracula you know but definitely go check out the last voyage of demeter i think it's a good watch and if you're a horror fan if you like vampires uh this is a good watch so go see it but until the next time guys i will see you later be safe and Bye-bye.